What's going on? Corey Nice here. Today we're going to talk about building out a sales page or or making sales pages. And I'm going to focus on sales page number four of the Power Lead system. Let me flip my screen. So sales page number four of the extra website section. I'm going to show you what I mean because I really think this is like the most popular sales page template that we have. Um, so it's right here in the upper right hand corner. So you got to click here for more choices right here where this text is uh, highlighted. So make sure you, you see that it's really easy to miss. I clicked website and then to the right. All right. Click here for more choices and it's going to bring you to this section called mysharecodes.com. So click sales pages and then it's going to give you these mobile responsive templates. So we're going to use number four today. Um, you would copy this code and paste it into your system right here to my sharing codes. I've already done that. So I'm just going to go over to copy web page section. You always want to copy it. If you're trying to customize a page, you always want to copy your web page. So I'm going to do that and I'm going to show you guys how to edit out uh, the videos, how to change the videos if you want to do that and how to play around with this uh, template. And this can be used as a long form template as well. If you want to put in text, um, extra copy that like, you know, goes, goes down a page, you can do that too. If you want to put in a ton of videos, um, you can definitely do that, do that with this page. If you have a lot of videos you want to share, like on a sales page, obviously, then this is the template for you. So let's see here. Let's do, um, sales page number four test. I don't know, something like that. I'm just going to go here, sales page four. I'm going to show you guys how great this sales page works here. I'm going to click save changes. Um, I'll just leave that the same for now, edit background, and then I'm going to go into the text. So immediately, if you want to put a headline in here, all you got to do is click enter, move your cursor up, and you got a space to, um, you know, to make a headline. So let's see, I'm going to do that. This is where your headline would go. So you can customize it. Don't just think that what you see is just what you get because you can customize any of these pages to look basically however you want. I'm going to make this like 36. Maybe um, you want to change the color. It's black. I can put that in as white. So I, I've done this before and made sales pages with this one so many times. So I know that that looks a little bit better. Maybe I want to bolden it, make it stand out even more. There you go. So that's where your headline would go. Um, this is a picture. Watch this video. That's a picture. So you can edit that out. You can put in anything you want. And then there's the video. Here's the button section. And then here's, um, you know, the rest of the videos. I, I like to always kind of hover or use the right hand side here because I can keep track of the videos better. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six. So they got six videos. Um, let's see here. If you want to delete them, all you got to do is move your cursor down, hit delete, and then delete the iframe, and then delete that section. So now there's five. There should be five videos. All right, so maybe I want to leave like four or whatever, just showing you how that works. So um, fully customizable. Let's scroll back up. All right. All right, so one, two, three, four. So now there's only four videos underneath and you got one at the top. So um, you can take out all these videos underneath too. This again, this is a picture. Um, and the button section too is kind of tricky. So I'm gonna show you how it works here. So it looks like right now I can click either of these buttons. I can click a button and if I wanna change it, I go to the image and I just click the image and then I'm going to click browse server. So again, let me show you how that works. Click the button. So the blue text highlights it, go to image and then browse server. So I can change it out to any other button I want. And these are, um, buttons saved in, in everybody's library, I believe. So maybe I want to put in like, start my free trial, right? Maybe I want to put that in. Uh, maybe I want to make it a little bit bigger. I don't know, whatever. 
So I'll put it like that. And then maybe I want to put in the link, obviously, to the actual, to the right place. So I put the link in to the seven day free sign up. Let me go here, paste that in. I could set the target, open into a new window, or you can leave it um, not set. But I'm gonna put new window, click OK, and then there you go. So then I would want to probably delete this one, leave that there, and then if I want to put in a new button, all I gotta do is hover the cursor to the spot where I'm gonna do that. I can put in a button underneath to start my free trial, and maybe I want to put in like the free lead system picture. Maybe I want to put that in. Um, keep it about the same. I think it was a 400. I forget what I put. What was the width here? What was this width? So you can see the width. Okay, the width is 450. So I want to keep that looking clean. I want to make that. I want to also make that a 450. And then I could put in a link to uh, to the free lead system. So these are just random ideas. Obviously. Put in whatever business you're promoting, um, but if you're promoting Pirate System, this is a way to do it too. Then you got two buttons there. You can put in as many buttons as you want. Um, you can put in custom buttons. You can add your own pictures to this page. Now I'm going to show you how to edit the video section because I think that's important to do that too. So anytime I edit the videos, I'm always gonna. I, I almost always go to the source code. So I want to click source. And then I'm scrolling down and I'm looking for um, an iframe text and um, YouTube and bed words. I'm looking for that. And I know there's an easier way to do it to pull up, to pull that up, um, you know, with your laptop and your keyboard. I don't know how to do that off the top of my head. I know our, our founder, Neil Guest, has showed that before, but. Um, I don't know how to do that, so I, I just use my eyes and I look. So if I want to change out the background, I know this is the background image, so I would replace that with the link right here between the quotations. But anyway, I'm showing you how to change out the video. So here it is, iframe, like I said, full screen. So I'm looking for that. So I'm going to grab the less than sign. It says less than all the way to greater than. I'm going to grab that out. I'm going to delete it, and I'm going to add... Um, you know, like a, a YouTube video. So I don't know. I I made this last night about the new um the new product that we launched, which which features the top um top earners or the top some of the top leaders in Power Lead System, I should say, which is awesome. So I would go to share, then I would click embed. I don't want to show player controls. I want to remove that, make it look as clean as possible. So I want to take that out. I don't know if it actually makes a difference uh, looking at it. I don't, I don't know if it does. But anyway, I want to click the code. I want to copy the code. Notice how it's less than to greater than. All right. And then I'm going to go back. I'm literally going to paste right where my cursor was because it's the exact spot it's supposed to be. Then I'm going to hit save changes and move to the next step, my friend. Then I'm going to click view your web page. And voila, it's really that easy. It's really cool how easy it is to do that. If I want to put in more videos, it's the same thing. You just swap it out. That's why it says swap. You put in whatever kind of uh, videos you want. So for illustration purposes, I'm going to show you how to do that again one more time. All right? Because this is the, probably the best sales page template that we have. This, this sales page template you'll probably use a lot. You can tell it's just super clean, easy to put in buttons. Um, it, it's just a great template. So I'm going to do that real quick again, okay? So I'm going to put in maybe something else like Power Lead System. I don't know. Like um, Actually, I want to do Power Lead System Review. So I'll search that, and let's see here. Yeah, this is the one I wanted to get, that one. So remember, you go to share. So underneath your YouTube video, click share, and then click click embed. It's kind of up here. It's under share a link by the social. So click embed, click the copy or the, um, the code. Click that code. And then I'm going to go back in here and edit text. And 
it's in the source code. So I'm going to edit out the second video this time on this sales page. So I'm going to scroll all the way down. I'm looking for the iframe. There it is. The first iframe allows screen. So that was the video I just put in. So I'm looking for the second one underneath it. You can see here's the link to my trial. So those are the buttons. So I'm looking for the second one. Aha, here's the second one. Oop. The second one's right there. So less than sign all the way to greater than sign. I'm going to take that code out. I'm going to delete. My server is right where it needs to be. So I'm going to just hit paste. I pasted in the code to that other YouTube video. I'm going to click view your page. We got the first video and now we got the second video there and that's how it looks. So this is a great page if you have a lot of video content to share. Then at the bottom you can put another button in if you want to do that. Um, I'll make some quick edits so yeah before my computer dies again. I'll make some quick edits here. So at the bottom, I always like to usually update this to like 2019. You can put in like your business name or whatever, Coach Corey, coaching. And then I'm going to scroll up to the top. Again, actually, no, I'm going to hit Save Changes. I'm going to hit Save Changes. And then I'm going to hit Edit Background. So you can edit out the background. Um, this is the default one for this sales page. I'm going to put in, I don't know, this one I've never used really before when I don't use I don't know maybe you want to make it black make it like a black background so like that and I'm gonna hit save changes and I think it might it's gonna let's hit let's hit refresh and now it's different there you go here's the sales page this is where your headline would go watch the video buttons you got the cool background so that's how sales page four works. Um, if you're not part of Pirate League system and you want to start, I want you to click the link below. I want you to uh, get the free lead system and sign up for the seven day free trial. Just go through both of those links. Or if you know you really want to use it, you can skip the free lead system. You can just get right into the seven day free trial. You can start using this sales page four template and all the other templates we have. Um, I will help you personally make pages that you want to use to grow your business. So I hope you enjoyed. If you did, also hit the thumbs up. That would mean a lot to me. But most importantly, please drop a comment below. What other videos do you want to see? What content do you want to see me talking about? Was this useful? Um, do you have questions about this specific video? Um, just drop a comment below, whatever you're thinking, and I'll see you on the next video. Take care.